All right, we're going to do a little test here between the new Makita brushless top handle, 10 inch, versus, I don't know, the two year old DeWalt. All right? But before we start, I want you to grasp the difference between these two. Now, obviously, one's a top handle and one is not. One's a 10 inch, one's a 12 inch. Both are brushless, but if you've seen my original video, or my review on this uh, Makita here, you heard me talk about the weight, all right? And that's what I want you to get out of this. All right, we're gonna start with the Makita here. Let me take the cover off. All right, 5.4. All right, you're talking almost a 50% difference in weight. And the biggest thing is the Makita cuts probably twice as better too. Let's see these two in action against each other. All right, here's the Makita. Full five amp hour battery. Here is the DeWalt with a full five hour battery. All right, let's start with the DeWalt. All right, we're going to start with a 2x4. You can see the difference. Uh, we'll, we'll talk about this later in the video, but you see how fast this chain? Wait until you see the Makita. The Makita's chain move. Not a Makita. But check out the rotation or the spin on this chain. Incredible. Ready? About half as quick. Let's try it again. All right, got around a two and a half inch piece of uh, white birch here. Let's see what the DeWalt can do. Not bad. Let's see what the Makita does.
nice one for Lissy. Let's try. Alright folks, you just saw the Makita 10 inch top handle versus the DeWalt 12 inch XR. Go head to head on a couple different applications, a 2x4, a 2.5 limb or a branch and then a 9.5 to 10 inch piece of white birch. Alright, you've seen me do this with the DeWalt probably in 3 or 4 videos. Um, you know, again, both of these saws are not the type of saws or the size saws size of a saw that you should be using on a 10 inch piece of you know oak birch maple all right these are you know for limbs four by fours stuff like that um obviously this top handle has a much faster um chain speed than the dewalt but i think for 20 more dollars you're going to get a much more versatile saw with the Makita. For one, it's a top handle. Uh, two, it's more powerful. Three, it's lighter. Four, it's more comfortable to use. Uh, I'm not a big fan of this DeWalt. I mean, it works. All right. I, I just, you know, I would take it over the Ryobi 12 inch. But besides that, this is, you know, I haven't used the Cobalt. I don't even know if they have a 12 inch that they make. But out of all the saws that I've tried in the 10 or 12 inch uh, range, this would probably be the last one I recommend. Uh, leaks oil like a sieve. Like a sieve. That was As soon as I laid it down here, we had oil, you know, everywhere. Um, so it's a leaker. But you guys heard me talk about that before. But listen, if you're into Walt's platform, this is fine. It's going to work, right? It'll get the job done. But if you're in both... My opinion, I'd go with the Makita. We'll catch you. Wait. What's going on there, folks? All right, real, for, real quick first. I want to thank my man Robert Bates. Awesome. Awesome, dude. He gave me a boar's head. Remember, save somewhere else. How's that? What's the slogan? Oh, I forget what the slogan is. Cut pennies somewhere else. I don't know. And look at this. Oh, they're going to be, the kids are going to be fighting over these headphones here. Earbuds. We got a hat, some earbuds. Look at this. Boar's head official. Cutting board. Robert Bates is the bomb. I appreciate it, Robert. You are, I tell you, you meet some really great people doing this. And that's probably been the best, what I've gotten out of this. Sandwich spreader. Ideal for spreading cream cheese, peanut butter, jelly, and other condiments. Oh, man. And look at this hoodie, boar's head hoodie. Oh, and he said sweatshirt. Oh, oh man. Look at this. Man. This is, uh, this is something. That's very nice. I got board, look at this, boar's head sunglasses. I'm gonna be hitting the beach with those on. And Whoa, look at this. I appreciate it, Robert. A couple bottles. Bring these out. And I think I got enough pens until the resurrection. Or the second coming. I 
That's nice. So. Much appreciated, Robert Bates. You're the bomb.